Hello everybody and welcome to this microeconomic video on consumer and producer surplus. So firstly consumer surplus. What is consumer surplus? Well consumer surplus is defined as being the difference between how much a consumer is willing to pay for a good and how much they actually pay for that good. So say for example I was willing to buy a new phone for £450 but I managed to get the price of that phone, I managed to buy that phone for £350. So in that case my consumer surplus would be £100 because I was willing to pay £450 for it but I ended up only paying £350 for it. And we can show this diagrammatically as shown here. And our consumer surplus is shown by the shaded area. And this is because this is the, the area between the top of the demand curve. The top of the demand curve is the top price at which people are willing to pay and the equilibrium price, how much people actually pay. So the shaded area between them represents the difference between the two and therefore consumer surplus. Next on to producer surplus. Producer surplus is defined as being the difference between how much a producer is willing to sell their good at and how much they actually sell it for. So in this case we're talking about businesses and companies and them selling their goods. So say for example a business was willing to sell their good for minimum £100 but they sold it for £120, their producer surplus would be £20 because this is the difference between how much they were willing to sell at and how much they actually sold at. And this also can be shown diagrammatically as shown here. And the shaded area represents producer surplus. And this is because the bottom of the supply curve is the lowest price at which producers are willing to sell their good at. And the equilibrium price is the price they actually sell their good at. So therefore the shaded area represents the difference between the two and therefore producer surplus.